This is safety. But even safety can be bitter. These people are refugees. They fled clashes near their villages in Western Democratic Republic of Congo. But in this camp, in the neighboring Central African Republic, there is little but shelter. Gamulko Bozika walked 20 kilometers with his family of six children to get here. Now, they're almost starving. Water is precious and hard to get. There's only one pump, and the lineups are long. For the sick of the camp and the local village, the clinic offers no medicines except painkillers. Two of Moyanze Florence's six children are in the clinic, both because of malnutrition. Here, at least, they get basic meals. The clinic's doctor is Amadou Matius. Among the desperately ill he's treating is this baby, bathed in a purple solution as a last-ditch remedy. UNHCR's protection officer, Antoine Surungra, says he and other aid workers are simply overwhelmed. Euh, du fait que présentement nous sommes limités, nous lançons un appel au, à la communauté internationale et aux bailleurs de fonds de venir au secours de cette population en détresse pour pouvoir octroyer les moyens nécessaires pour souvenir aux besoins de cette population. Gamul okay. Kobozika and his family, like other refugees here, feel almost abandoned. They can only pray for more aid, more food, more medicine, and hope that the world has not forgotten them.